Forge and Dialga and Palkia are coming to Pokemon Go this weekend, but I got access to them one day early through a secret add-on you could buy. Today we're going to be checking out these Pokemon, testing out their new adventure effects, and doing this all before anyone in the world. Let's get into it. And here we are officially in LA. It is 9 a.m., which means we are here for the first exclusive early day of the Sinnoh tour. As you can see, plenty of things changing over to different shinies, but mainly what we're looking for today is gonna to be those new origin forms and being some of the first people in the world to catch them. But as you can see here, there's actually no origin form raids on our nearby. And that's because for some reason, for the first 30 minutes of every hour, you get the original form of Dialga and Palkia. And for the last 30 minutes, you get the origin forms. So we're still gonna have to wait 30 minutes before we can actually raid these. But for now, let's go ahead and hop in the car, start shiny checking and wait for those eggs to hatch. Man, I'm so excited to test out these adventure effects. What is bro doing? Bro, oh, why are you raiding Dark Side? <laughs> because he's better than Dialga, Yo. bro. <laughs> okay, well, while we wait for this raid to hatch, because I think that's going to be an origin form finally, what you will notice is this is what the space-time distortion looks like. It's kind of hard to see because of this um, party we're in, but kind of makes the sky all cool. And this is something that's going to be happening as well during the global tour, so you can expect this. Let's check out the encounter screen with it. Ooh, that's kind of cool. The Snover, nice and orange. It kind of reminds me of the uh, Koopa Unbound event we had. 30 seconds until we have our official first the first origin forms ever hatching. Ready? Get ready. I'm excited. Here we go. I'm we excited. ready? 10, 10 9, 9, 8, 8 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. 1. What's it going to be? Happy Palkia, day. please. Palkia. <laughs> Let's check it out. Oh. <laughs> Bro, mine's taking forever! Yes, Dialga! Dialga! Why are you excited? I need, I need this! Okay, let's go, Yo. let's go, let's do it. The first origin form. By the way, if you're curious how to take down Dialga, it's going to be weak to ground and oh fighting type. I'll put our counter guide graphic on screen. Check that out. Use that for the global Sinnoh tour as well. I'm sticking with a party of Shadow Extradale, Keldeo, and a bunch of Shadow Machamps. Here we go. Origin form Dialga. The horse. The iron horse, they call it. I'm kidding. I'm going to call it that. Oh, it's getting shredded, though. This thing, by the way, is going to be a beast in the Master League rank 20. And then also it'll be a good dragon type ray attacker because it's a part steel type, so it resists oncoming dragon attacks. Can it be shiny? It can yes. be. Yes. Okay, let's go, let's go do yours first. Let's do yours first. We ready? No. Oh, that looks amazing. It looks though. so nice. That looks though. amazing. Yeah! Let's go! Okay, well here we go. We got our Diago origin form. Now the question is, are we gonna get the legacy move? When my mom catches hers, since she has the diamond badge, she should be guaranteed. But since I have the pearl badge, I'm not sure if it'll have Roar of Time or not. Yeah, it does. It does. Yours does? Yeah, we Mine got, does. We yeah, got yeah, Roar yeah. of Time. Bro, what's the point of even choosing the diamond badge? Okay, so that means we can now use the Roar of Time adventure effect. It's also got the background. Let's test this out. So Roar of Time, distort time for six minutes, it pauses incenses, lucky eggs, star pieces, and daily adventure incense. Let me go ahead and use my daily adventure incense. We can now go ahead, use Roar of Time for a duration of time. But let's go ahead and use it. I'm gonna go ahead and use it just for six minutes. Use the Dialga adventure effect. Oh my God, look at this. That looks really cool. And then now time is paused for certain items. So yeah, you can see the lucky eggs, star pieces, and daily incense. The timer just stopped. This daily incense and all the items are still being used. We can test it. So yeah, there you go. Star piece is still being used, but the timer is not going down. Okay, here we go. The Palkia now. Let's go ahead. We're going to remote raid this one just so we can do this quick without having to move. Again, this thing is going to be weak to dragon and fairy type. Again, check out the counter guide we created on screen. If you want to know what the best Pokemon to take it down, and the 100% IV are. Okay, here we go, Origin Palkia. In terms of the meta relevance of Palkia, it's actually gonna be the new number one Master League Pokemon in the game, an absolute beast in terms of stats and moveset. You're gonna want this Pokemon for the Master League. And then also, of course, it will do well as a dragon and even a water type raid attacker. So again, there's no reason you shouldn't be raiding these um, Origin forms. And there we go, Origin Palkia going down. Can we get the shiny though? That's gonna be the big question. No, I cannot get the shiny. This thing looks insane though, 2318. There we go, caught Palkia origin form. And we did get the adventure effect, which is cool. Spatial Ren, this is the adventure effect I'm more excited about. Now this one is gonna manipulate space for the next 20 minutes, allowing you to find Pokemon encounters from further away. Pretty much allowing us to double the spawn radius. Let's go ahead and check it out. We're gonna go ahead and use it. It's gonna activate for 20 minutes. And when you do activate, you can only have one adventure effect at a time. Gonna go ahead and use Spatial Ren, really, really cool here. And there you go, double the spawn distance. Did you see a bunch of some more spawns just appear? We can now reach this Swinub from all the way over here. Like this is just, this is clearly probably gonna be the better effect because it'll pretty much just allow you to grind more and catch more spawns. Something I'm actually curious about though, 
is let me go ahead and put on my auto catcher and let's see if the auto catcher is actually able to reach those extended spawns or not because I know there's been issues in the past where the auto catcher cannot reach the extra distance. And yeah, look, you can see that effect there. I don't think it's fully double distance, but it's like, it's about 1.5 the distance, I think, based on this visual line we can see here. And yeah, there you go. See, that Burmy is not in range, so the auto catcher actually does work with the spawn double distance, which is actually huge information. Using spatial rend is just gonna increase the amount of catches you can get, which is just a win-win. It's clearly probably gonna be the better effect. Okay, let's go find some more rigs. Try check number two. Not gonna be shiny on the Palk yet. Okay, and here we go. One more Dialga going down. I believe that's four raids then we've done in the hour. And it is not a shiny. It is 9.59 now, so I don't think we're making any more raids. Which means now we have to wait another 30 minutes for more raids. But don't worry, we're gonna be doing plenty more today. Okay, well that was a good first session. Now we gotta wait 30 more minutes. We're gonna hop in this coffee shop, get ourselves a drink. It's kinda interesting. It's gonna be like 30 minutes on, 30 minutes off. Can you just let everyone know how casual I make you look, Luke, when you play with me properly? <laughs> sure, mate. Okay, and here we go. This is gonna be the last raid of the second batch here. We got a Palkia. I really want the shiny Palkia more than the Dialga, to be honest. I feel like these adventure effects are gonna be really big. It really does suck that, again, it's kind of pay to win because you need to, you know, get Palkia candies, which obviously you can do with rare candies and stuff, but you have to do a bunch of Palkia raids. But man, like, again, I'll put a screenshot on screen, like this adventure effect with the double distance, it's gonna change the game for grinding events, and it's gonna be a necessity for on, honestly any event where you want to catch a lot of Pokemon, doubling the spawn radius is so huge. I'll stop talking about it though. Let's let's do some more raids. Let's try to get this shiny. Here we go, shiny check on the last raid of this hour. Can't really see yours, but can mine be shiny? Because that's all I care about. No. no. Okay guys, for some reason we were able to find another Palkia raid. Um, I don't know why, but this one kind of snuck through their 30 minute limit. Not complaining though. Can we get the shiny though? Is going to be the real question. No, we cannot. This one is 2361. Isn't that pretty good? That's pretty. I think it's 64. 67. No? Oh. Really close, really close. Damn it, I'm just so bad at this game. I can't get the hundo. Skill issue. Let's see the IVs. Got the background. I think every single one comes with the back. Okay guys, we've made it here. We got the Walt Disney Concert Hall behind us and we found another Dialga to do. We've just been crushing these raids. Now while we hop in this, there is a actual Rotom research you can get right now globally for free, I believe. If you come to this website, the Niantic store backslash PokemonGoLive.com, just search Niantic Redeem. And then if you paste this code right here, no spaces, go ahead, pause the screen, get that code, click apply. Bang, you've successfully redeemed a exclusive research for Rotom and I believe Rotom can be shiny. Now, if you are globally, maybe wait till the global tour because there might be shiny boost for Rotom, so it might be better. But yeah, that is a code you can go ahead and get right now. I'm sorry, it's crazy loud right here. Let's take this Dialga down and shiny check it. Can I press Good. this one for you and get it shiny? If you press this next one and get the shiny, bro, I'd be kind of mad to be honest, but <laughs> also I'd be happy because I got the shiny. 22.95, not very good. But that doesn't matter because, because it's gonna sparkle. With the casual touch, you ready? The Three, casual two, touch. One. You're never touching my phone ever again. <laughs> okay guys, the time is officially 1 p.m. which means we are halfway through this event. We're on our way here to a uh, Palkia origin rate, but I wanna give you guys a little info on the shiny rate for me. I've got two shiny Pokemon in about 500 catches. Granted, I've been running my auto catcher all day, but that gives you kind of an idea of what I've gotten. Now, Trevor has been a lot more lucky. You've gotten, what, what's your ratio, bro? I've gotten 875 catches so far today. Okay. Much more than And me. I am sitting at 19 shinies. Oh my God, bro, your luck's crazy. Yeah, so yeah again, my shiny luck's been bad, Trevor's hasn't been good. Overall, I, I think the shiny rates are still decent for this event because I... Have you guys gotten a decent amount of shinies? I have four. Five. Four? Okay. I've got a turret week. As long as you go in with uh, not a lot of expectations, you should have a good time. And again, at the end of the day, the only shine I really care about is getting the origin, so we'll see what we can get. Casual coops in the wild. <laughs> with a frying Why pan. Why a frying pan, bro? This is what you're making me do. You said you're allowed to come away with me, Pony, if you do what I say. Ooh, look at that! 
Oh, did you? You got it. I got a shiny. Yay. Poke Mama. Okay. Yay. Is it a Shando? Is it a Shando? No, no. Oh. Can I get the twins with Poke Mama? Yeah, come on. Like mother, like son. No. Oh, oh my sorry, dude. God. Sorry. I got the candy cane one. Oh, it's like a Barbie. We then met up with over a hundred trainers to do a huge raid train over the next two hours. We're gonna fast forward this because we have a separate video coming on it very soon. Stay tuned. I then had to go to a meetup, so I gave Casual Coops and Trevor my phone to try to catch me a shiny while I was there. Right, you lot. It's Coops and Trev B here. Um, Dax left us for Mystic 70s pop up shop. Of course. Can you believe it? Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable, Dax. That was. And obviously Pokemon. But they're heading back now. But he left us his camera and. His Foam. So, bro, you've not got a shiny yet. So here, no. Is it? No. no. Trying to. So no shiny and no uh, good IV. Thank God. No, one more. <laughs> not another shiny. Oh my God, I'm so sorry about that, bro. Oh. I'm not loving no. this at all. That you're getting nothing. No. Oh wait a sec, he's phoning me. Wait a sec, dude, dude. We're literally just about to do your shiny check live. Are you ready? You're on. You're on. You're on the video. You ready? Okay, bro. You ready? <laughs> all right. Yeah. Are you ready? You're about to get nothing. You ready? Three, two, one. Oh, oh, sorry, oh. mate. Sorry, buddy. Okay, well, unfortunately, the boys were uh, unsuccessful in getting me a shiny, but we are back raiding now. It's about 2.15, which means a little less than three hours left, and still no shiny origin in sight. Will we get it? Will we not? Special delivery. Oh, my God, my water. Thank you. <laughs> I don't pay him. Nonetheless, we are having plenty of fun here raiding, so it's uh, it's been a blast of a day, even if I don't get the shiny. But who'd be sick to get at least one of the shinies? Come on, can we finally get a shiny? No, Mama, you can hit it. You know it's gonna be nice. oh. Raid number eight hundred and fifty-five. <laughs> here we go. Come on, don't Three, be shiny. Two. Don't. Yeah, no, don't. Yes. No. Oh my. God. Okay. Okay, sick. Found a wild home slice hander. We're gonna trade Origin Dialga. I'm excited. I'm excited. I I have low expectations because <laughs> I know when I go in with high expectations it doesn't come up good, but let's go here. That's fair. We've been lucky friends for probably multiple months. Yeah. Probably close to a year at this probably point. Close yeah. to a year. Come on, big money. If let's I go. can get the, the Dialga that he uses in his videos, bro, <laughs> that's free let's see free it. viewership. 23 to oh 14, 14, 15, 14, how'd you do? That's, that's okay, it's okay. I'm probably gonna transfer it right away, but still, <laughs> hey, thank we you. Got bro, we got it done, we got it done, we got it done. Unfortunately, no shinies from the raids, but there is still eight minutes, so we're gonna try to get one more raid in. First, though, we have some eggs cracking here. We got the Carnivine, these are the 10Ks, which can hatch the new, um, whatever, the new regionals. No shiny yet, we got one more here. We got a Pachirisu, not gonna be a shiny. Still, these are regional Pokemon, so they actually kind of are rare. Yeah, we got this Dialga here. Eight minutes left. Let's see if we can clutch up the shiny right before this ends. Come on, come on, come on. I'm checking it. Three, right. two, one, let's go. Oh, oh, no, that's not it. I keep thinking it's it, because it... No. Okay, I think we can do one more. Let's see if we can get it. Okay, guys, final raid. It is 4.58. Final raid of the first day of Sinnoh Tour. Technically, we shouldn't even be playing Sinnoh Tour on this day. This was not advertised. I just want the shiny. Here we go. Final raid. Final Dialga. I want the bulky, but whatever. Okay, down it goes. 22.87. It is not a good IV, but that's not what we're here for. Ready? Pokemon. No, I, I gotta do the honors. I gotta do the honors. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh. Devastation strikes. <gasps> They're still here. It looks like some of the origin form raids, there's two actually that didn't expire after five, which means you can actually do more raids. Just we'll meet you at the raid. Thing. Okay, somehow the raid hasn't disappeared, which means you can actually do more raids before they expire, which means you should have about 15 minutes left of raiding if we can find them. A little overtime action. Can we get the overtime shiny? Here we go, down goes Dialga. 2275, please. If the Pokey God could ever bless me, it would be in the overtime rating of day one of Sinnoh Tour. <sighs> I'm on 50 raids without a shiny. Damn, Dax. Okay, guys, well, it is officially 519. We have a bunch of raids tracking, but we gotta head home. I gotta get this footage uploaded. And honestly, I'm pretty tired. We've been playing for eight hours. So I think we're gonna call it there. In terms of shinies, we ended up with six today. Six? <laughs> oh, no. Pretty brutal, but we did get the Mime Junior again. Let's be, on, let's be honest, I was mainly focusing on, on raiding, so I don't really mind. Why are you laughing in the back? <laughs> <laughs> I did get one hundo, a hundo Porygon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, relax.
lie. The most important thing is I had fun, and I hope everybody else had fun. Guys, we got plenty of fun videos coming out during the Sinnoh tour, so do not go anywhere and stay tuned. And as always, follow for tips, everybody. Peace. Yo, if you dance, give you extra shiny luck. Does it? You do the two step? One. Two. Go get dance rate, hey, 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 dance rate, hey. Yo, Becky, cut this, cut this.